previously in Cyberpunk 2077. Okay. I'm ready. Tequila old fashioned. Top it up with beef and sprinkle in some chili. Silverhand special. Let's get out of here. Tell you what I heard. Then you'll show me if I'm right. Did we do anything that I would regret? Remember how we said you were just gonna talk? Yet yeah, you ought to be the one puking here. You ought to be the one puking right now. Yeah, well, life ain't fair. Don't mention it. It's money well deserved. All right. You've received transfer. That I have. I'm a little bit more wealthy now, which is good, because I have to pay for some very serious car repairs now. And now to continue. Okay, so... What to do next? I think... What are Maelstrom doing here? Never mind. It's afterlife. They have just about everybody. Uh, not now. <laughs> uh, one of these days maybe I'll do her racing. I just... Mm, I'm not... Confident in my racing skills. I mean, I can barely drive. What makes anybody think I can race? This is an elevator. Huh. Never noticed that before. And again, the news broadcast has no audio. That's weird. Alright. I think what I'm gonna do is... I've, I've still got more time before I can get into Riot. So I think I'm gonna go do some odd jobs and things around Watson, since I'm finally back in Watson. Um, got a couple of gigs for Regina and all these NCPD uh, buzzers, and then there's these. That... I don't know what those are. What is an episode? What is an edge runner? Still very confused on that. I wonder if that has something to do with that, um... The coat I got. I still have that coat, right? Yeah, this coat. A jacket for a true edge runner belonged to David Martinez. I wonder if they're related. Whether they are or not, point is, I have time to kill. Actually, I think... I've got some cyberware that might need upgrading, so I think I'm going to go see Vic, and then we're going to go do that. Because it's nearby. But yeah, first first I want to go see Vic. So... Where's my Porsche? Where's my car? Oh, for the love of... Patsy. Okay, well, Vic is not that far away. I think I'll just take a stroll. Don't worry about getting in the vehicle. Excuse me. Sorry. Just don't want to waste a lot of time on these streets. Here we go. Is this a shortcut? Is this a shortcut? Kind of. Have I been to this marketplace? Actually, you know what? Yeah, I think I got lost in here once. Just like I'm getting lost in here now. Caliente? That sounds like a restaurant, but the door's not open. 
How sad. Checking them out? Barely no, illegal. Me. That's all. Oh yeah? Because when you get those kind of tunes. Hey, Misty's place. Okay. So what happened to her? She died that didn't take that long. Nah. And Gary the Prophet, he's just kind of sleeping. Isn't that the guy who was basically claiming that everybody was a bunch of lizard people from a different planet? Chat about the good old days? Oh, I didn't know she had her own hollow sign. Hey, Misty. I'm just off to see Vic. Sorry to cut through. Aww. The kitty cat is gone. All right. Hey, Vic. I'm here to get a tune-up. thinking about swapping some chrome. Got any new toys? Excellent. Let's do this. You don't say, huh? Chill, please. Sit down and relax. Sure thing. Let's see what we got. I'm ready. Carve away. Okay. Oh, God. I don't have much of anything. And he doesn't have any... He doesn't really have much of anything either. Well, I mean... Uh, he's actually got quite a bit. It's just I can't afford any of it. Tatertronic Rippler Mark IV... Raven Microfiber Micro Cyber. <coughs> I really want to get a legendary cyber deck. Netwatch Net Driver. Damn it. I can't afford any of these. 80,000. 80,000. Ah, here I was hopeful. I don't even have any upgrade parts. Like, I can't just simply... I'm sorry. What the hell is that? I don't remember... Johnny. It doesn't even do anything. Johnny. I mean, seriously, man? At least have it be, you know, of use. Uh, whatever. It's a little bit of money. I suppose I could have kept it. I mean, it was a unique item. Alright, we're gonna sell this. And upgrade it. I know, I just spent more money than I... You know what? Fine. I'm not equipping it, but I'll at least keep it. It is unique. It's too bad it can't be upgraded, and it doesn't do anything. But there, I've got Ballistic Coprocessor co Tier 5. Ricochet damage and all that fun stuff. That Not that I care about ricochet damage, but... Armor carry and stealth? What does this one do? Carry, reload, and aim. Okay, I might change that, but for now, we're okay. And this was to help me with smart weapons. I kind of want to just upgrade that for the secondary slot. I mean, I like that tattoo. But I could also get something like this. 20% target lock duration. And plus two max RAM. Oh, that's better. That's definitely better. Alright, I'll buy that too. And I think that's about as far as I'm going to go. Something tells me... Yeah, I don't have enough money for anything else really. Carry capacity. Health attune plus bonus health per attribute. Armor, melee, and explosion damage. I mean, that could be useful, but I haven't really struggled with carry weight. 
I mean, usually if I get over encumbered, it's because I'm carrying too many guns, and the solution to that is simply disassemble the guns. Turn them into crafting components. Well, hey, I could do that. I could upgrade this at least. 41 armor versus 49 armor. Decreased enemy vision, bonus health, and bonus melee resistance. Yeah, okay. We can do that. There. I think that's about all I can do, though. I don't want to go overboard. Yeah, I don't want to go overboard. He's got all legendary stuff now, which is great. It's just I can't afford it. I can't afford any of it. I need to go do more jobs and earn some quick cash. What other options? What are these? Automatically, automatically negate an enemy quick hack and plus two max RAM. That is actually quite useful. What do I have? Plus five and upload speed. RAM recovery. And instantly recover max RAM when available RAM falls below 20%. Oh, those are all really good too. I do like that idea though. Automatically negate an enemy quick hack. Hmm. I'm sure, yeah, it's got a 30 second cooldown on it. This one's got an 80 second cooldown on it. Plus, I mean, there are plenty of other perks in the intelligence tree. If I really want to worry about RAM recovery, there are a lot of other ways I can go about doing it. So I think I will sell this one. What does this other one do? 35% damage against drones, robots, and mechs and turrets. I, see, I don't have a problem with damage against those either. I just don't. Like, all I need is short circuit, and those things all die instantly. So I'm going to go with this one. Because the idea of immediately negating an enemy quick hack, like, those things hurt. They hurt quite a bit. So I think I'm going to stick with that. And we're good to go. Not changing my double jump legs for anything. Double jump is just too awesome. Way too useful to be getting rid of it. What do we have here? Heal on kill. When you neutralize an enemy, plus 5% health. Now that's really useful. Minus 15 stamina cost for shooting. Not as useful. Oh, I would love an upgraded blood pump. I love the blood pump. I think it's fantastic. And this as well. Because the this automatically triggers this whenever I get below health. And this thing recharges really fast. Yeah, definitely, definitely want to upgrade those as quick as I can. Says I still got a blue. There's okay. Blue dot's gone. Let's just there. All new items have been surfaced over, and I think that's all I can do. All right. Thanks, Vic. Really appreciate the work. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. I'll be back as soon as I can afford a new cyber deck. Because I absolutely want a new cyber deck. Oh, Nyx. Thanks again. That That's it? Just thanks again? I mean... You're welcome. But why the delay? Alright. No matter. Okay. Uh, oh. Sounds like... Ah... Uh, Sounds like our prophet is, uh, awake. I guess we'll go talk to Gary. Their bodies, they never age! 
but notice their eyes, cold and dead. Yeah, you are calling them lizard people. Their corporation exists only as cover for their wicked means to live, or rather, to remain undead. I tell you now, Saburo is not gone from our world. He rests undisturbed in the family crypt. He You're... feasts on the blood of his servants, awaiting his body's rejuvenation to return once more. Mark my word! I mean, they really are. You're, you're not wrong, actually. That wouldn't be a total shocker. Said on TV, Arasaka's working on immortality tech. A hollow lie to conceal their inhuman nature. Really? Seems it more believable. Flows not through technology, but through their undead blood. Right. But how could mere mortals become these death-defying abominations, you ask? With the help of techno-necromancers from Alpha Centauri. Ooh, it was their tainted blood key. Saburo Arasaka drank to transform himself into this devil spawn. Gary, you can't spill Arasaka's secret. They gonna find you! Let them! The seed has been sown. The truth shall sprout roots and lift us from the invaders' clutches. Um. I recognize Dude. you. Dude. You come here often. You need to work your on, on your, your propaganda. Your mind has opened to the truth. Will you provide a humble donation so that I may continue my mission? Humble, yeah. Um, 6,000? I don't have that much. I don't have that much. But I would pay it if I did. Uh. Humble sounds affordable. Just don't spend it on stupid shit. Thank you. This has bought me a day or two. Really? I gave you a dollar, man. I'd give you more if I could, but I just Radio spent a whole bunch. Let those with ears listen and those with eyes All right. I mean, he's a quack, but he's harmless. Ooh, let's go see what that is. Not that far away. Roughly right around the corner. Oh, and my active main job changed again. That's annoying. Okay. Only 100 meters away. Uh, looks like I can just cut through the park here. I'll never understand how it is I can go from having half a million eddies nearly to nothing in like five minutes how do I find ways to spend so much oh wow I have enough RAM to do Ooh, I want to test this but we're gonna do it from a safe distance do 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 Oh! Oh, that's gonna be so useful. Hey, now that I think about it, Claire, those races. Could I blow up the cars in the race? Oh, I'm going the wrong direction. I actually needed to be down there. Ah. Okay, then. What do we have going on over here? Maelstrom. Right. Um, how do I want to do this? I have a lot of RAM all of a sudden. Wow! Okay. Let's do that.
Easy peasy. <laughs> Suddenly I can't walk on stairs. What the hell? Ah, uh, come on, guys. You're making this way too simple. Is she down? Looks like she went down. Well, there. Someone shoot her before it's too late. Well, they won't be bothering any civ civilians anymore. Y'all need to stop harassing people. And what are you screaming about? You're fine. Shoot her before it's too late. Dude, I just saved your asses from a bunch of maelstrom goons. What? Rogue. V, how's it going? Feeling better? I'm chatting with my people, and it looks like we might have a lead on Grayson. Uh yeah, cool. I'm great. Let's go. What what's what's the game plan? Sit tight for now, I need to comb through the some intel, but it looks promising. All right. A lead is always good. Okay. Yeah, I don't want you coming back and causing problems for people. And you just need to be put out of your misery. That was a mercy. Shoot her before it's too late. Oh, for crying out loud, I am going to shoot you if you don't shut up. What do we got? Oh, some good money. See, that's why I like these jobs. Money. Lots of money. What's on the shard? Genki's family wrote to me as they were preparing the body for the funeral. They found someone had torn out all his implants. Checked it out, Genki flatlined in Leaf's shop. Looks like that piece of shit got a little side thing going, selling off our boys. Kill him. Oh, this was a revenge job. And do you... Leaf and Yuri. Leaf, got a fresh delivery to pick up. Yuri, you all, all unlocked? Leaf. You know it. Reset to factory. Ready to implant. Can sell it straight. Yuri. Okay, I'll send someone tomorrow. Leaf. Preem. Just keep it quiet, alright? Can't have this all over. Yuri. Chill. No worries. Later. I see. But that doesn't explain the maelstrom goons. At least not very well. All right, let's go do. Wait. What? Someone shoot her before it's too late. Is that Gary again? <laughs> Why do I get the feeling that's Gary again? What's Gary got to say for me this time? Bruce finished him off too quick. I like listening to his rants, even though they're really just whack. Who are you? And why is there a skull above your... Oh, your net watch. But what they don't know, the real name for this thing they call cyberspace is actually... Pandemonium! Gary, you're getting some fans. What is life without its body? What are the beings of the net if not souls from beyond our plane of existence? I have heard their voices. Let they who yet live never cross that threshold, for their souls will join those ghostly ranks. I met a corpse in cyberspace. You know, I've been in cyberspace, and I did actually meet a corpse or two there. 
Hark the witness! Hear her testify of those who burn in hellfire! Yeah, didn't see that fire, though. You ask! Who opened these unholy gates of the abyss? No one's asking. The, the, the technomacker. The techno necromancer! Yeah, the techno. Of Alpha Centauri. Oh, Gary. You can I ask for money you. again. You yeah. Here often. Your eyes tell me that your mind has well, There's a tarot card the nearby. Will you provide a humble donation so that I may continue my mission? I just got some cash. Can I do more than. Hey, I can actually give him something. You do good work. Use this to wake Night City up. Thank you for your devotion. I, I suppose I didn't need I to do that with my gun drawn. Than you from the very beginning. No, I just he helping someone down on their luck. That, that's all I'm doing. That's all I'm doing. Okay, we're gonna switch back to that one again. And good. And those with eyes behold. And now we're going to go see what this gig is all about, because I still have a lot of time to burn. At least I think I do. Where's my Where's my clock? 2.07 p.m. Yeah, there should be just enough time to do whatever these are, and then we can head over there. Now, this one should also not be too terribly far away. It's over there. Took me a minute to see it. The question is, once I get there, sorry, sorry. What's the job gonna be? And how hard is it? Please, just, just please don't give me anything that says, "Oh, stealth is of utmost importance. Don't kill everyone." Whoa. Oh. Hostile area. Well. I think I have a solution for this. Now what's inside? Can I open the door? Whoa. Is there going to be someone in the... There... Oh. You don't look so good. Military grade Aramid net running suit. Quick hack components conversation. <clears throat> Gene Kiri. And Shiva, you ready? OMG, I thought you will never write again. I asked if you ready. Of course, tell me what to do. We have outsiders in town, far from home, Moscow. They sniff around Night City around Pacifica. We need to know why. Hack the embassy server, copy all files about the visit. So you're from the Voodoo Boys. You're Shiva, and you're from the Voodoo Boys. If you succeed, you prove your worth and become a voodoo boy. Oh, an initiate. OMG, yes, I'll get to work right away. You can count on me. I'll be waiting tomorrow at midnight. So Gene Kiri was your contact in the voodoo boys. Something went horribly wrong. Regina? <clears throat> uh, oh, I have a little job for you, a wellness check for a Militex brat that fancies herself a net runner. She told me she was doing a big job for the Voodoo Boys, and I haven't heard from her in a minute. I think I remember this one. Daddy pays the rent on her den, and since it is in Tiger's part of the concrete jungle, he had security turrets installed, so watch your ass. Yeah, the security turrets weren't a problem. Foolish gonk, I tried to warn her about the Voodoo Boys, but she never listened. Thanks for checking. Yeah, yeah, sure. But while I'm here... 
Used leather combat boots. Tier 5. Alright. Interesting. Oh, you've got another one. Uh, missing persons. Locate. Location. Dima does above Do Doozle Saint. Doozle Street and Kennedy Avenue. Okay, one of my informants saw a bunch of Bryce Stones hustle beating the shit out of a pawn shop owner. Normally hearing about Bryce's Bible beaters curb stomping some poor gonk wouldn't interest me, but the televangelist himself was there. I need you to go and send me the, any deets you can find. <clears throat> uh... Sure? Seems a little suspect. Bit of an odd job. Anything of interest on here? Need some stuff. Gina, I got a job from the Voodoo Boys. Finally, it's a big one. Gonna need some better cooling. Best thing would be some liquid nitro foam. You got anything like that? Pay you after the job. Malware. Dear sir, madam. Yeah, those are scam mails. Local network is down. I can always shop the net. I don't have any money. I just spent all my money on cyberware. Right, okay. Well, that was for another gig. How are we doing on time? I've still got a ton of time. All right, let's go do this really quick. <clears throat> It's nearby. I don't want to wander too far away. Because I want to do this Lizzy Wizzy job and go confront Mr. Liam Northam. So I don't want to be doing jobs that are going to take me like all the way across town and stuff. Where is this shop? Well, there you are. Hi there. You? I'm here to do biz. Need to buy some meds. Actually, I'm here to sell things. Lots of things, hopefully. Because I have a lot. You know what? I'm going to get rid of a few drinks and stuff. I really should eat these. I don't ever feel hungry. So they just sit here and collect... And yeah, I keep holding on to them when I could be selling them and making money. Like it's not a lot of money, but every eddy counts. What else do I have I could sell? Oh my god, a lot, a whole heck of a lot. Let's start with just getting rid of duplicates. Uh. That's a duplicate. Oh, I've got three of these. Good grief. <clears throat> and a lot of these are for weapons that I'll probably never use. Which means they're just pure eddies. There we go. That gets rid of all the dupes. Uh, I'll keep all the rares and... The tier 3s and tier 4s for now. Just in case. And I don't need that. Huh. Let's just sell all my junk. I'm almost back to 50k. Uh, do I have any duplicate? I do. I have two tier 5 memory wipes. Don't need two of those. Reboot optics. Sonic shock. Looks like I got two short circuits. Don't need both of those. System collapse. I mean, these are all great quick hacks, but I don't need duplicates. Just one of each is fine. There we go. And now I've got some, some money. Like, some good money. And I could get some more by selling these guns. Uh, but I don't have any quick... Wait. Vendor doesn't have... I took all the vendor's money. Okay. 
Uh, sure. Yeah. Um, thanks for doing business. I'll, I'll be on my way now. Didn't mean to take all of her money. Didn't realize I had that much to sell. Or I didn't realize she didn't have that much money. I wasn't paying attention. I was just wanting to get stuff out of my inventory. Oh, can I go in here? No. Nah, it's probably around the corner somewhere. Like in there. Oh, are you hostile? Let's see. How do I want to do this? Let's do a short circuit and a memory wipe and see what that does. And then maybe I can do another short circuit. Oh, that is fun. Okay. I only see one other one. Tigress, Tiger Claws. You guys are really, like, out of your... Like, I don't think you're supposed to be here. There we go. Ah, poor guy. Conversation. Hunter and Max. Max, someone sent her something or emails. Don't ask how I know, I just do. This is bad. Yeah, fucking bad. No more messages or calls. Left the fly the files for you where we had lunch. It's got my body cam footage, but I warn you, it's like watching a nightmare. We drowned those villages in napalm and we made sure everyone was home first. Take care, watch out, don't just don't trust anyone. Times come to leave NC behind me. Okay, hope it all works out. Oh, so you did some shady stuff for the military. And I'm guessing that information was worth something because these jackwads came looking for it. Could be right. Could be very wrong. I'll never know. Oh, uh, let's see. Well, that's a problem. Um. Okay, so if I go here. Let's do that one. Perfect. I've got a lot of quick hat components. Maybe I should sell a few of those. Especially considering I don't need them anymore. So let's sell those and buy some uh, other upgrades instead. Max Jones, Hunter. Blah, 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 blah. Neat. This is Max Jones Media. I'm gathering material on the corporate wars in South America. Yep. I called it. He did some shady stuff for the, the corpse. Found your name in some Kandachi docks. See, you were there as part of the humanitarian expedition in 2068. I'm sure you signed an NDA, but maybe you could still talk off the record. I can promise you complete discretion, Max Jones. Am I sure I don't know that name? Sure, would love to meet you, you're right. I did work for Kandachi then and take part in the Columbia mission. You're also right, it was in no way humanitarian what we did there, honestly. I've never talked to anyone about it, not my friends or kids, not even my wife. My first instinct was to delete your message, then I realized I couldn't keep silent about this anymore. I don't expect redemption or forgiveness for my crimes, but at least the world will finally know the truth. Meet at my store. Make sure nobody follows you. 
Ooh. Don't know if they followed him, but they definitely followed some kind of trail. Alright, what time is it? Come on, tell me I've killed enough time. Two third. Oh my god, I've still got so much time. Oh. And it looks like there might be more to say on Gary's behalf. Let's go talk to Gary again. Why not? Today's adventure is brought to you by the Lunatic Prophet. We'll just cut right across here. Pardon me. Coming through. Okay, I think it's safe to put the gun away at least. Oh, there it is. That's what I'm looking for. I think. Oh, not quite far enough, but yes, right direction. They traverse the bad All right. Trucks, yes, but when the full moon rises, they remove their human masks. And what hides underneath, you ask? What are you Reptilians? Checking them out? I answer you, no! Not reptilians, but werewolves. Oh, yeah. Werewolves now? At sunset, they strip off their clothes and dance nakedly, giving in to an animalistic ecstasy. Then, once they've transformed into the fanged beasts, they set off on the hunt, hungry for human flesh. Who are you talking Dozens about? Miles they cover in the darkness with ferocious speed, like arrows in the night. Uh, I've met them. That's definitely not them. Nomads, and there's definitely something primal about them. Those cannibal claims cross the line. Though. Deny the truth all you want. But what will you do when the pack hunts you down? And the cause behind these monstrous horrors? Years ago, a ship from Alpha Centauri crash landed in the Badlands. Legend tells okay, no, ser seriously. Highly sought after hey guys, the elite in our you're all the Caldos, right? They could transform Saburo's enemies into werewolves, leashed and bound to his will. But the crash. Well, you got a problem with nomads, freak? Better shut your fat fucking mouth before I put you six feet under. Guys, guys, you guys. Can break my bones, but you cannot stop the pursuit of truth. Leave him. He's harmless. Hey, hands off my spiritual leader. Seriously, he's harmless. Just got a few wires crossed. Leave him alone. You know how many half brain gunks are gonna believe the shit he's spitting? I refuse to hear about nomad cannibals one more time. Come on. I mean, it's it's a little funny. Guess you. Guys, come on. Ugh. Seriously, I'm. I'm. <clears throat> okay. This is a problem. I don't want to kill them. They're all the Caldos. Guys, guys, come on, we can talk about this. You know what? Leg shots. I don't want to kill you. Damn it. The truth cannot be silent ever. No problem. Okay, I mean, he's fine. Me fake the Mars landing if I let him knock your teeth out. Damn it, I'm on a shit my words, do you? You think I don't know when I'm mocked? When they take me for a false prophet. Ah. Uh, there is a grain of truth in what you're saying. Your interpretations seriously, but there is a little truth in what you say. Sometimes even more than a little. You see it too. You know that behind a veil of darkness lurk creatures from our nightmares, but you fear to believe it. No, you don't understand the shit no, I've uncovered. You had any kind of real evidence for this grand cosmic plot? I do. Tonight, they're meeting at an old factory in Kabuki to exchange something important. Oh no, not tonight. Seize this item, this Alpha Centauri artifact. You'll see I was right from the beginning! Why did it have to be tonight? How do you know about this meeting? Wait, wait, hold on. How do you even know about this meeting? Their radio waves resonate within my brain. 
Ever since the accident, I've heard their secret broadcasts. Accident? The accident. You know that doesn't instill confidence, right? You don't understand! I have their code processor in my head! I don't know how my Ripper Doc got his hands on it. But thanks to this, I can listen into their plots and schemes. If you help me, we can save this planet together. All right, all right. I'll entertain this this theory of yours. Okay, see what I can do. Thanks for the tip, I think. You mustn't intervene too soon, or too late. All could be lost. The fate of humanity rests upon your shoulders. Don't let us down. Do not let me down. No pressure, got it. Oh. And where is that exactly? Wait, you said Kabuki, right? Isn't that... No, is Kabuki... Kabuki's up here, isn't it? Ah. Go to the old factory. Okay. It's not far. But... Why did it have to be tonight? 